Hey guys, Christian here. Today is Friday, April the 15th. No, my bad. It's April the 10th. I just time traveled for a moment there. It's April the 10th, 2015. That's where I got the 15th. And uh, yeah, so today's Friday. That's cool. Um, going to the weekend, important stuff going on. Watch Thursday's video if you haven't already so that you understand what's going on on the weekend. And then I'll see you guys again on Monday. However, before I cut up this video short, let me uh, update you guys on a couple things. Um, first and foremost, I finished the Holman Christian Standard Bible that I had been reading. You guys know that I like to read various different translations. Every time I read through the scriptures rather than going through the same uh, translation again and again, I picked up the habit of reading a different translation. So having finished that one, I got a hold of my sister, asked to borrow her translation because she has the New Living Translation. And so I have got that now and I will I'll be reading that starting today. So I'll be doing that. If you'd like to join me, feel free to do so. If you've not ever read your Bible before from cover to cover, uh, I recommend you do so. And if you have and you're looking for to do it again, well, join me, okay? And we'll be doing that. So, having said all of that, I would like to take a moment to um, thank you guys, those of you guys who watch, and those of you guys who comment and uh, share the videos and so on. And I'm going to tell you why I want to thank you. I have long hair. I don't know if you've noticed. And... I also have, uh, well, now I've got a t-shirt, it's got skulls all over it, we'll talk about that in a minute. Uh, I've also got black fingernail polish on. Um, by every measure, right, that somebody would look at me, they would, if you were stuck in your religion, you would run the other direction. And the guy's got long hair, he's of the devil, he paints his fingernails black, he's of the devil. skulls on his shirt, he's of the, I can't tell you how many times growing up as a kid, I heard of the devil. Um, anyway, yeah, we're not going to get into all that, but... I just wanted to say that it's, it's an awesome testimony to you that you don't turn run the other way because you judge something by its appearance. Uh, when God first told me about the lottery, my first response was that. I was like, that's of the devil, it can't be of God. And I dismissed it. It actually, I mean, you guys wa have watched the video, I'm sure. Uh, if you haven't, you can go back and watch it. The, back, the very first video I ever uploaded on this channel talked about how I experienced that, what, what God said to me, what my response was. And it was that I didn't understand what he was talking about. I didn't know that a uh, lottery is based on a lot and the casting of lots is something that's been throughout scripture for a long time and the fact that scripture says the Lord maintains a lot of the righteous and I go on and on and on but the the point is I judged superficially all right and so I know that whatsoever God is in me he's going to do the church the one thing that God told me so that when I see people that come along and they initially hear something that God has told me and they dismiss it I'm like I, I've been there I've, myself, so I'm not surprised I will do that. So to me, it's a huge deal when I put up a video, and I have people that subscribe to the channel, comment to the channel, like the comment, what, whatever it is, and they are not judgmental. I've had lots of people stick up for my long hair and stuff like that, because that's something that people like to argue about. Um, and just for the record, that particular detail, I prefer short hair, uh, actually. I mean, when I was a kid, yeah, long hair. But when I grew up, um, I preferred short hair. It was easier to take care of, easier to manage. Uh, I'm pretty big into uh, investing, so Wall Street, short haircut, this makes sense to me. Uh, but I got long hair because one day God told me, I'm going to cause your hair to grow long and you're going to shave. Yeah, I'm supposed to shave my face, right? So I do. That's it. Uh, my response to everything is simply whatever God tells me to do, I do. But I've noticed recently it's getting more prolific, right? It's like the long hair, now I've got the black fingernails. Uh, I'll talk about that in a minute. Uh, the, now my wife, she picks me this shirt up yesterday with skulls all over it. I'm thinking to myself, you know, it's like it, the more this stuff gets poured on me, the, the more uh, repulsive I'm going to be to the religious, you know. And if that's the way God wants it, that's the way God wants it. Um, but just the, for the record, it doesn't, it's not what it looks like, okay. I uh, just want to share it with you. I remember I have been biting my nails and so one of the methods I found that works to teach me to, to stop is that I paint my nails black and then whenever I go to bite my nails I see the black and I'm like reminded oh yeah don't do that and so I put my hand down it's a good good thing right it makes sense to me um, and black is better than red so yeah I got no problem with that however right after I paint them I had to go to church on, on Wednesday for Bible study so I'm like oh here we go you know and everybody was cool Nobody brought it up. I brought it up to the pastor because he started talking to me and I thought he's going to notice it. He's going to be like, oh, it's awkward. So I thought I'd just toss it out there for myself. He didn't even notice it. So not everybody is how I expect they will be, but some are. And you just love them too, Eric. Right? So I just want to thank you guys for your support, for um, 
doing what you're told. Scripture tells you to judge not by appearance, but with righteous judgment. And some of you have done that. And that's why you're here, right? I just want to thank you guys for that. Okay. God bless. Take care. Enjoy your weekend. Be safe. And I will see you again on Monday.